Hi everyone, my name is Dr. Paulo Antonio Almeida. I am a psychologist. I'm here to help you to get it off from anxiety. Today I'm talking about anxious preoccupy attachment style. Understand characteristics and management. Attachment style is a theory uh, found in the 50s, in the last century. And uh, the two authors uh, wrote about how people uh, are conditioning from your childhood uh, had in relationship with their parents. So we developed our attachment style in this kind of relationship. And it's important to know about this because uh, attachment theory uh, we fear as uh, our primary attachment style and how we cope with the, our uh, relationships. Uh, and of course, uh, because these we could be more anxiety or not. Understanding the characteristics, considerations, and strategies for managing an anxious, preoccupy attachment style can provide valuable insights into one's behavior and pave the way for healthier and more secure relationships. What is anxious, preoccupied attachment? Anxious preoccupy attachment is an insecure attachment style that develops in early childhood based on the quality of the child's relationship with their primary caregivers. It's characterized by a strong desire for intimacy combined with doubts and anxieties about abandonment and rejection. People with uh, anxious preoccupy attachment style often seek reassurance and validation from their partners experience a deep need for closeness and connection. I think it's very common people uh, with anxiety uh, feel like fear of abandonment, um, like a high sensitive to the possibility to, of rejection or abandonment. They often worry excessively about their partner's feelings and intentions, fearing that they will be left alone. The, uh, behavior and belief about abandonment uh, are present in all human beings, but in this character specific attachment style, the people who care more about this. Excessive need for reassurance. Um, anxious, preoccupied individuals constantly seek reassurance and validation from their partners. They require constant reminders of love and affections to alleviate their insecurities and doubts. Overanalyzed behavior. People with anxious, preoccupied attachment style tend to overanalyze their partner's actions and words, searching for hiding meanings or signs of potential rejection. They often interpret neutral or ambiguous behavior as a threat to their relationship. Difficulty with boundaries, those with Anxious, preoccupied, and attachment style often have difficulty to find a balance between closeness and personal space. They have this difficulty to put limits and boundaries in their relationships. Emotional roller coasters. Anxious, preoccupied individuals experience intense emotional highs and lows, uh, lows with their relationships. They may become easily overwhelmed by negative emotions such as jealousy. Just loosely, insecurity and fear leading to frequent mood swings. Clinginess in need, to, in need for proximity. Anxious, preoccupied individuals strong desire physical and emotional closeness. They may exhibit clinge behavior and have difficulty being alone, seeking constant contact and reassurance from their partners. I think it's very about um, the to know about these characteristics because, uh, first of all, when you know about this kind of characteristics inside yourself, you could cope more easily, easier in this kind of uh, problem with your relationship. Uh, of course, living with anxious, preoccupied attachment style can present challenges in relationships. 
uh, then we could uh, feel more anxiety about this. Um, it's not about thinness. This attachment style is more about deep city fears and needs than being clinched. Understand triggers, of course, certain behaviors in others, like not respond to attacks quickly, might trigger anxiety. When you know what kind of thing, what kind of triggers uh, up your anxiety, you feel looking for, searching for. Uh, a specific behavior, a specific relationship uh, could help you to cope in an easier way, easier way uh, with anxiety. Communication, open or honest communication is crucial for individuals with anxious by attachment style. For every, everyone, but in this kind, expressing feelings, concerns, and needs to the partners can help alleviate anxieties and foster a deeper understanding within the relationship. Self-care, take care of one's emotional well-being, is vital of management, managing an anxious preoccupied attachment style. Engaging activities that promote self-soothing, such as mindfulness exercise, journaling, or hobbies, can provide stability and security too. Build your self-esteem, of course, developing a strong sense of self-worth and self-esteem is essential for individuals around the world, or all, all kinds of people, but in this styles more specifically. Uh, what kind of strategies for managing anxious by attachment? Developing self-awareness, increasing self-awareness of one's attachment style and you uh, know more about yourself, uh, challenge negative thoughts. You could train your mind to let go your negative thoughts. I have a course and I have a book about this. I will uh, translator to English too. Practice mindfulness, of course. Meditation is obvious, is the most uh, important tool uh, for, for people cope uh, for anxiety. Communication skills, you learn to express your needs, fears, open, honest, and healthy way can minimize, minimize misunderstandings. Developing secure internal dialogues, you cultivate a compassion, uh, self-compassion, learning to appreciate health boundaries and to stay building secure relationship is very good, very important to, to think about how uh, you could stay in balance, in peace, in health state, in, in peace inside your body and mind, of course. So if you like this video, please subscribe my channel and thumbs up. And if you want to have uh, psychological therapy with me, please uh, send a message here in Instagram and we, we, we can do uh, the psychotherapy during one hour per section and you, we could treat, treat your anxiety in a better way. Thank you.